Hi there. Now that we have discussed about the switches and how to interface them with Arduino, we can interface the Arduino in any way. We can interface the switch in Arduino in any way. The most preferable and the simplest way to interface a switch is by connecting it against the ground and enabling the internal pull-up register. If you do this, then you don't need to connect this external pull-down register. So, let's try to write down a program you like this by making the switch go input with its pull-up enabled. When you enable the pull-up or when you enable the internal pull-up, then the pin is by default held high or logic 1. To do this program, what we'll do is uh, we will follow Tinkercad where we can simply create this program as well as upload it and see the output immediately. So this is just an Arduino. What I want uh, with Arduino in Tinkercad over here is a switch like this or a push button like this. That's about it. Now interface it, connect one pin of that switch to let's say pin number two and other pin to ground. Let's just change the color of this wire. And now let's start writing down a program for it. So the program for it would be void setup and then void loop. What we want to do is when the switch is pressed, the LED should turn on. Where is the LED? Let's define it. Int LED is equal to 13. Then in setup, pin mode, 13 comma input underscore pull up. <clears throat> and then we also have to set the pin mode of, oh sorry, pin number 13 is not input pull up. Instead it is output and then pin mode two comma input underscore pull up now to use it all you have to do here is in void loop if digital read then specify what pin you want to digital read in our case it is two or let's give it a name sw like that so int sw is equal to 2. So if digital read SW is equal to equal to low, what it simply means is if the switch is pressed. So if the switch is pressed, what we want to do is digital write LED comma high. And on the contrary, you can use either else statement or much better if you particularly check if digital read SW is equal to equal to high then what we want we want that led to be low or turned off let's start the simulation and let's see the output so we started the simulation now i just have to press this switch can you see the led turning on over here as soon as the switch is pressed and when i release the switch the led is turned off practically it will happen immediately to give an effect that LED is uh, turning off slowly, they have uh, faded the LED as the supply is removed here. In practical, when you are doing it with hardware, you will find it to be happening immediately. So that's a single switch interfacing program with Arduino. Try it out and let me know how it goes. Thanks for watching this video.